Aha. I knew it was still here. I knew we'd been here before. We claimed it as part of the Ronin Kingdom. And it still is. <clears throat> All it needs is a little update. What are you doing? What I wanted to do back then, but I didn't have the guts. There, looking better already. You're right. Way better. So, what's the plan? We go inside and calmly ask Eddie why he was there that day. All right. Let's try to let him get his side of the story out, okay? Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. I understand, Mr. Barrow. I'll be sure to let him know. Yes, I have it all written down. Have a good day, Mr. Barrow. Morning, Missy. How do you get stuck working reception? Rose called in sick this morning. I'm covering for her while I try to get my paperwork done. What are you doing here? Just checking in with Uncle Eddie. I'm guessing from the identical features that this is Tyler. Tyler, Denise, Denise, Tyler. Wilson, could you tell Officer Vincenzi that I'll be... Oh. Good morning, Allison. Hi, Uncle. I'm going to take Dr. Torres' statement. No need for Vincenzi to come back to the station. He doesn't seem like he's in the best of moods. Yeah, I don't know what's going on, but he's been a little off all day. Good luck. Great. He has an excuse to brush us off. I'm sure he'll make time if we say it's important. Who designed this building? MC Asher? Leia is totally bizarre. It actually used to be the offices of a chicken farm. <laughs> Seriously? Seriously. Oh. Hello, kids. Hello, middle-aged adult. Morning, Chief Brown. Good morning, Tyler. Hey, could we talk to you in private? It's a little urgent. Can you excuse me for a second, Dr. Torres? <sighs> What's going on, you two? We had a few more questions about our mother. Look, now's not the best time. Well, maybe we can come back later then? Excuse me. Come on. Guys, I'm understaffed today. I've got a receptionist out sick, an officer dealing with personal issues. I need to finish taking this woman's statement and I don't have time to chat right now. We were just hoping for some answers. Well, I don't know what more you think I'm going to say. I already told you everything. I need to get back to this complaint. Sorry, guys. Oh, I hate when he's stubborn like that. So what now? Of course, Miss Torres. Where were we? Well, he's obviously not going to give us the truth. So I say we go get it ourselves. Where do you think they'd stash her file? I don't know. The archive room? Maybe Eddie's office? Wait, you're not seriously thinking of breaking and entering a police archive. Go big or go home. Who designed this building? MC Asher? Leia is totally bizarre. Two 
up to over there? Everything all right? Uh, yeah, everything's fine. We're just, uh, I was just telling Tyler where the upstairs bathroom is. Tyler, help me out here. Oh, uh, yeah. Toilet emergency, lake water, you know, Mother Nature's juice cleanse. There's a bathroom just past the break room, behind you. First door on your right. Forget it, Tyler. There's no way we're getting upstairs out in the open like this. It's too suspicious. There must be another way up. Maybe we can check out that map of the building near reception. Oh my god. Why didn't I think of that? Lobby. Now. All right. Let's stare. Fire exit. It opens up to a staircase on the side of the building, but it'll definitely be locked from the inside. If one of us were to create a diversion, the other could slip upstairs and open the door. And since you're the troublemaker, I nominate you as the one to make a scene. Wait. Really? Got a better idea? Looks like this is where Brown keeps all his personal mail. Looks like he's working with the Office of Child Services on the case. None of our business. If Eddie catches us in here... There's no turning back now. Why is Brown on a first name basis with the director of Fireweed? Oh. What'd you find? It's an invoice. Eddie Brown, you'll find and close the final invoice for resident Tyler Ronan. The Fireweed Administration would like to thank you for all of the support you've given us over the years. I knew Eddie pulled some strings to send you there, but... <laughs> that's a lot of money. More backdoors and secret moves. Maybe he didn't want to make you uncomfortable. Well, now I feel like I'm in his- You applied to a summer drama program back in 2009? I did, but they rejected me. Michael and I were supposed to go together. He went, but I was stuck here for the summer with no one but Justin Beaver for company. Why? Well, uh, this letter says you got in. What the hell? So he just turned it down? I'm sorry, Allison. Shouldn't be surprised he's lied to me in the past. <sighs> Personnel files, department budgets, but zero case files. Hey, you. Huh. The Dallas Police Force is getting a new officer. Seriously? You're gonna try to hack into his computer? We're here for information. And computer- Whoa. Brown looked at our file this morning. Wait, what? What does that mean? I don't- I don't know. But there's a reference number. R68653. 